Well, what if someone you know was diagnosed with Alzheimer's, but instead has a condition that can actually be cured? There is a common illness that can imitate Alzheimer's. CBS 2's Dr. Holly Phillips explains. I started to have balance problems. I would fall constantly. A few years ago, 72-year-old Barbara Adis's busy and independent life came to a screeching halt. I didn't want to leave the house, and I was very depressed. I stopped driving, I stopped really socializing, and I really thought my life was coming to an end. Out of nowhere, she developed difficulty walking, memory problems, and incontinence. I would come home and she'd be crying in the corner because she would fall so much. Her family feared it was dementia or Alzheimer's disease. Well, I was very upset. I didn't know what was going on with her. Months went by until an MRI proved she had a common and reversible illness called NPH. NPH, or normal pressure hydrocephalus, um, is a disorder where spinal fluid that's normally made in the brain is not being effectively handled by the brain. The spinal fluid builds up and puts pressure on the brain, causing the debilitating symptoms. Experts say 5% of patients with dementia, including Alzheimer's disease, are actually affected by NPH. And that number is expected to go up as the population ages. If somebody has been normal and robust and, and living a, a fairly active life and all of a sudden they're having much greater problems with walking and there's no clear explanation for it, it is certainly something that should be high on the list. It could happen to anyone, but treatment is simple. We put a little tube into the brain and that diverts the fluid down into the abdomen where there's plenty of space and ability for that fluid to be reabsorbed. I was in the hospital for five days, gradually, gradually. I started to recover, and it was amazing. Call her my miracle lady, and she is. Adis has a word of warning for anyone who experiences what she did. The key is don't accept being told that it's part of old age. Don't accept that. In most cases of NPH, no cause can be found, but the earlier it's diagnosed, the easier it is to cure. Don't hesitate to ask your doctor about getting an MRI if you notice symptoms suddenly. Dr. Holly Phillips, CBS 2 News. And it's worth asking because 90% of patients who are diagnosed with NPH will benefit from treatment.